Victor Karniep is the referee of this fight, and Andrei Goncharov with the red gloves, and Roman Gagulchansky with the blue gloves. The first round starts now. Very nice low kick by Andrei Goncharov. Another low kick. And as you can see, Romana Gulchansky already tries to take his opponent down, but didn't quite succeed in it. Very nice low kick by Andrei Goncharov again. He uses it very well. He repeats it several times. But Romana Gulchansky took his opponent down, tries to show some hammer fists. He's in the position where he can just defend himself and try to get to the mount. It's a guard position. But, as you can see, Romana Gulchansky didn't close the guard. He uses some punches to the face. And this is a triangle choke attempt by him, but still they are working hard on the ground. Romana Gulchansky understands that he should, he should fight here in this position he's winning he is controlling his opponent in this position and there is nothing that can uh, andre gancharov do here as for right now maybe right now he can show us the triangle choke And as you can see, Romana Gulchansky gets to the body several times. One more to the face. He's still controlling his fighter, his opponent, his rival. And uh, the most important thing is that he's working. He is uh, not only controlling on the ground, but he punches to the body, he punches to the face, he uses elbows. All possible techniques he shows us here. And obviously he won some major parts of this round. Still continue to work as a striker, as a stand-up, in a stand-up position. Another attempt to get to the ground, to take to, to the ground by Romana Gulchansky and Gincharov separates. There's a miss by right cross of uh, Romana Gulchansky. He's not very keen off as a striker, but as a grappler, as a mount and ground position, ground and pound, he could use it very well. Still working at the fence here, Andrei Gancharov controls the leg for some time, but right now his opponent escapes. They are returning to their center of the cage. Not showing us the speed they had at the beginning of the round right now. But, as you can see, uh, Andrei Gancharov understands that he lost 
some moments in this round and he has to recuperate right now he has to show that it's not quite easy to win the round with him even in their first even on the ground so the round is over but i still think that roman agulchanski won it because he had more time of controlling his opponent more time of ground and pound he used that moments very well and i think he won this round even if he maybe lost the final part of uh, the minute of the last minute of this round The second round starts right now. Roman Angulchanski is higher a little bit and he has a rich advantage. He can use it. Both fighters showed us low kicks. Another low kick by Roman Agulchanski. I think Roman is not very interesting in, interested in uh, striking games, but he wants to show us a, li a little bit. And after that, obviously, he will try to get his opponent on the ground. They were spinning. Another attempt by Romana Gulchanski. As I can see right now, he's not very sure in his striking abilities. And he wants to get to the ground his opponent, but he understands that it, it's going to be hard to do right now. First of all, because uh, Andrei Gancharov understands what Romana Golchanski is going to do. And if he understands that, it's very hard to get him on the ground, but still, it's not impossible. Another attempt. He took his uh, leg, I mean, uh, Romana Gulchanski took the leg, but did it suc didn't succeed in transferring his opponent on the ground. Another attempt to take double legs. It's kind of like uh, Jordan Burroughs, famous wrestler style. Andrei Gancharov had right now left uh, hook. There were some back fists from uh, Armana Gulchanski, but he didn't get to the face. Another one by Andrei Gancharov. Nice right hand, left hand, I, I'm sorry. He's a softball. Yeah. 
When you fight a southpaw like uh, Andrei Gancharov, you have to always move to the left in order to use left hand and right cross. It's like a mirror. Nicely done by Andrei Gancharov. Romana Golchansky missed. Spinning back elbow. Try to uppercut by Andrei Gancharov. Gancharov tries to get to the face, but wasn't able to do it. Another attempt by Roman Agulchansky to get to the ground. Not very intense fight, as you can see in the first, in the second round. And the takedown attempt by Andrei Gancharov at the end of the second round. And the round is over. So, Romana Golchansky won the first round and Andrei Gancharov won the second. And it was obvious like a day, but if it's so, the third round will be decisive. Andrei Gancharov starts carefully. Roman Agulchansky is doing the same thing. Gancharov's at the front kick. Left hook by Gancharov. Agulchansky doesn't use his uh, advantage height in height and in reach that is more important and I think disconnected with uh, his lack of uh, striking abilities he's more like a grappler than a striker he tries to use the grappling techniques more He's not very sure in his striking abilities. Oh, so he has some work to do in his training camp. Obviously, nice attack by Romana Golchansky. Another attempt to take his opponent down. But Andrei Gancharov understands all the the way that uh, Romana Gulchansky wants to show. And he stops him. And, and there is an, uh, another attempt by Agulchansky. Gancharov is here, is still working hard as a striker to hooks, went shortly to the face.
So there is nothing that Romana Dolchanski can do to win this fight right now. I think he's just surviving it. And Andrei Goncharov is controlling where the fight goes and how the fight goes. They are at the fence. Andrei Goncharov uses his knees, strikes to the knee of his opponent, tries to work hard, gets the leg, and maybe right now he will get his opponent down. Yes. He gets him on the ground, and right now they are working there, but Romana Gulchanski tries to stand up. His defense is uh, at a high level, but he has to show more. Has to show more in order to win this fight. Because right now, Andrei Gontrov is totally controlling, holding, and winning this fight. 40 seconds to go. Andrei Gontrov continues his way of uh, how he understands how he win how he can win of course and he's winning even though Romana Golchanski escapes very well from from the majority of the Andrei Gancharov's attacks he's still losing in their third round the last attack of both fighters was very good so it was a very nice fight and the game judges has to show and has have to decide who is the winner of the fight this is the fourth fight it's an undercard and after that we are moving to the main card of the AC-107. So here is the decision. Andrei Gancharov is a winner by unanimous decision.